action for us especially when we have a lot going on so I'm um, very happy to have had people over but also very happy that our house will be ours again but um, I know that in the last video I updated you with some of the weird symptoms that I was having uh, and it wound up being kind of a annoying complication so in the last video you saw me um, walking around Lo Longwood Gardens and um, doing really well after surgery, which is awesome. My stitches feel amazing, or lack of stitches, I should say. I don't know why I can't say stitches. I feel out of it. It's hard to talk. Um, anyways, so uh, the weird symptoms. I went to my regular primary care doctor because I couldn't get in with a gynecologist. And she said, you know, for the heck of it with your weird symptoms, especially the kidney pain again, let's do another urine culture. Guess who still has E. coli in her kidneys? This girl! <laughs> Which is probably why um, I haven't been feeling great. So you are about to see in the next few clips, um, we went out mini golfing and you might be able to see I'm not as happy or joyful in these next clips. the pain is nowhere near as bad as when I went septic with it um, because I was told the minute you feel any sort of weirdness going to your doctor um, so I have been on multiple antibiotics the last week hopefully one week is enough they're gonna retest my urine in uh, a couple days actually because I only have two more days of antibiotics and see what's happening if the E. coli is gone or what um, I don't know if it just stuck around or if I caught it again. I will say I've never had recurrent UTIs. These were actually my first UTIs ever. Never had them before, so a little bit weird. Drinking cranberry juice mixed in water, so hopefully that helps also, but it's just been a little bit annoying. So for the most part though, feeling good. Gained a little bit of weight, which is awesome. I actually hit 94, so pretty cool. And even um, just a few days on antibiotics, like last night we went to a farmer's market, which was really fun. And we really have been eating terribly this week because everybody wants to go out to dinner, um, which we're, we're just not used to. We usually eat at home for the most part. Um, 
So we got a great deal on ahi tuna. So I'm gonna make us seared tuna steaks and veggies. And we're gonna detox. <laughs> I was gonna film, but Zach is clearing the ice off of my door. Ah! So much ice. Here's, oh. a, here's a jacket. No. Nah. <laughs> oh, that's cold. I'd probably wear a winter jacket. Now, this is a very warm sweater, but that ice is freezing. All right, guys, we are here. Woo! Our local Quaker Town Farmers Market. It's just pure ice on the ground. We're walking into the farmers market. I'm excited because we have eaten out at restaurants all week, which pretty much killed my stomach. Remember the black and um, catfish I made the one time? It's a little spicy though. But it's tuna. Okay. Oh, speaking of, there's a Cajun catfish I made. All right, so we're just waiting for Tyler to get some movies, but I'm excited because we have eaten at restaurants all this week and we both feel pretty terrible. But we found uh, ahi tuna steaks. Really awesome price. Got at least three meals worth. Yeah. Four, so actually. We... we got a fourth one and then some uh, salmon with crab. Yeah. I'm very excited. Lots of meals for really cheap. I'm so excited. Five dinners for us. Plus, we still mm -hmm. have like I think five pounds of other seafood in the uh, freezer right now. Yeah. So we're gonna keep walking around the farmers market. I think it's closing <laughs> because it's snowing. So. It's a little icy. Yeah. A little still icy. Good one. And then Tyler's dancing. To Destiny's Child. Great band. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if that's them. Arcade. Mm -hmm. I'm more concerned with a sword shop. Yes, there is one. I, I know for a fact. Can we go? Antiques couple. I have some check. I'm not gonna ask some more. Here, tell us the directory. Oh, auction Amy. What is it? WWA. It might be. Ew, weird. Restaurants, hobbies, toys, videos, silent auction. Look at this. This is awesome. Original 1764 D for Quaker Terror Farmers Market, Land Side by John Penn. Wow. This has been around for some time. This is really cool. <laughs> Poultry auction. Oh. Partly destroyed in the fire. Oh, wow. Back in 1960. Oh, my gosh. Wow, open and despite fire. <laughs> Neat. This place is cool. You should come here more. <laughs> so, I love this. I love French onion soup, but it's really oily, and I don't know why I got it. I'll pay later. <laughs> I just gotta get a better floor. I'll go back there. Thank you. My belly is really big right now. Which is a good thing. I got this big puffy coat. <laughs> Are you gonna get dessert? No. <laughs> Salads and fish for the rest of the week. Seriously. You don't know how much like going out to dinner kills your salad. I concur. Because <laughs> that was a rough, rough week on our stomachs. Um, so you'll see that I we went out to dinner last night and we were totally over it. Anywho guys, that is my health update. Kidney infection or at least a UTI um, that seems to be in my kidney because of the pain that I'm getting on my right side again. 
Uh, Stitch is healing very well and able to walk around and sit without a butt pillow. And <laughs> I think that's it. Um, I definitely have more stuff I want to share over the next few weeks, so stay tuned. All right. Bye, guys. Do you want to put your hand in and say bye? <laughs>